I love how my exit saves just a pile of dead corpses in a little shed. Oh, you're looking for your owner? I think she's in there. Oh, yeah, here, here she is. <laughs> All right, but it was no secret that you guys really, really liked my Jeffrey Dahmer playthrough here in Fallout 4, so we're going to be continuing it today. And I added a few new mods to help make it a little bit more fun and immersive here for Jeff. Someone also mentioned that I spelled it Jeffrey and Jeffrey Dahmer wrong. So it's canon that his name is Jeff Uri, not Re. It's, it's early now. Get your fat ass out of the way. Jesus Christ, I can't move. If there's anything I can do to help. Oh, okay. Oh, I thought he was talking to a wall. I didn't realize he was actually talking to somebody. Uh, what a beautiful morning. Hopefully it's a nice hot one. So my, uh, my food can also be cooked in my little shed there. All right, what's next on our agenda? Go to Diamond City? They'd kill and kidnap one of their, uh, <laughs> city goers. So I'm curious if they'll actually accept me. Oh, okay. They, they don't seem to mind that I murdered and kidnapped someone and then murdered no, <laughs> actually i probably should be saying that out loud it's right i forgot to put on killable children uh i don't know if i want to get that dark though hey, i'm gonna follow you inside your home if you don't mind for the news lady she doesn't seem to be in in the scoop of me you know kidnapping and killing one of the people here in the city yeah my name's jeff uri not re so if that's misspelled in the paper i'm gonna come and kidnap your sister and eat her all right, Piper, be my companion. All right, Piper, I'm gonna show you my dark side. Hey, Piper, get a camera. There's a standoff going down in town. Oh, holy shit. All right, I'm just gonna eat you anyway. Right in front of the town. <laughs> Everyone's just mourning the, the, the guy who just got shot. All right, let's go uh, visit this Valentine guy before I eat any more people. Oh, I should give this guy a Nuka Cola and then he can be my prisoner for life. Yes, now you're in my debt. Keep that in mind. You're in my debt. Don't forget about that. Safe travels. <laughs> uh, he's gonna he's gonna walk into my shed. He's gotta be really, really confused. Need to find someone accepting of my lifestyle. Maybe when I finally find my son, he'll accept me for my lifestyle. Yeah, I'm not doing so hot on guns exactly. The only usable gun I have with ammo is the shotgun. All right, you got this, Piper. Yeah, good job, good job. There's some raiders. Perfect. Ooh, yes. Okay, all right, it's working. Now I can pick up human skin, meat, and blood. And with that comes some, uh, let's say some new crafting recipes. Come on, Jeff Furry. Beat the crap out of him. He's coming home with us. <laughs> Here we go. I got him. I got him, Piper. Oh, no, he died. Why the hell did he die? All right, Piper, just look away. Just pretend like you're not watching what's happening. <laughs> don't mind. Don't mind what's in my backpack here. Don't. Don't mind. Don't mind at all. Piper, I'm a little low in health, so I'm gonna need to eat something real quick. <laughs> She's pretending not to pay attention. <laughs> Piper does like that. Good. I need to find a melee weapon that'll count as non-lethal. <clears throat> there we go. Okay. Hey, Piper. Um, weird question. Could you hold this backpack for me? Ah, oh, you can't. Oh, no, you can't. God damn it. What are you? What is your use? You just make that stupid paper. Whatever. All right. You're going in my backpack. All right. Take the blood, the meat, and the skin. And I'm kind of hungry, so might as well finish the job while it's still fresh, you know? It didn't pop up that Piper disliked that. Maybe she's used to it now. All right, Piper. Let's just get the hell out of here. <laughs> we got to go save Nikki. All right. I'm just going to make sure I don't wake up the swan. All right, don't worry, Piper. We'll continue our rescue mission in a second. I have to go back to my house real quick to drop something off. Don't worry about what it is. All right, well, unfortunately, I can't make a refrigerator to stash all my bodies, so I'm going to leave the extra human meat and blood in here for uh, safekeeping. And now to drop off our new customer, prisoner, whatever you want to call it. Now you're here forever. Hey, Piper, I'm getting kind of hungry. All right, you need to get the hell out of the way now. Thank you, Jesus, he's, he died in front of my door. I'm the only one with a, like an actual house or shelter in the entire town. Oh, you don't, you don't mind sleeping among the bodies too? All right, who are we feeling like eating this morning? Um, let's go for Lucy. She looks delicious. Preston disliked that, Piper disliked that. Well, if you don't like my lifestyle, why don't you just... Yeah, you can't leave me, see? You can't. Yeah, the human blood and meat will show up in my aid section, so I can actually just straight up eat it, you know, just like that. But there's something a little bit more fun we can do with uh, some meat. Ah, yes, a strange meat pie. <laughs> it's a stealth field for 15 seconds. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but let's make a few of these, why don't we? Oh, here's an ice box. Oh, this this could be where I could uh, store my uh, extra meat and stuff. There we go. That looks nice. <laughs> Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> it took me way too long to find this, but it's under resources for some reason. Bruh. Yeah, good good one. All right, but since my new companions don't want to be, you know, optimistic or open about my lifestyle, it's time to 
put them where they belong. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's just... Uh, okay, this works, I guess. I'm relaxed. Yes, I, I am relaxed. Okay, Piper's in place. Where the hell's Preston? Preston, we're waiting for you for dinner. I wanted this in my head to be like a massive dining room hall, a massive table, and a bunch of chairs. Where the hell is Preston? God damn Hey there, Sheffield. Welcome to your new, uh, concentration camp. Perfect. There we go. All right, where is my food? Strange meat pie. Yeah, mmm, delicious. It didn't give me the eating animation, but yeah, you guys had to watch that. You guys stay safe now, all right? I'll be back. Don't you worry, Sheffield. All right, I'm gonna kill a couple of you guys, and I gotta keep the other one alive. Uh, hey there, buddy. Looks like you're our lucky winner. Blood, human meat, how are you? Wait, you were a ghoul, I thought. Uh, it doesn't matter. Still edible in my book. All right, let's just gun him down. Oh, I'm gonna have so much food after this mission. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> we're gonna have a feast in Sanctuary. Hold on, let me, oh, hold on, sir, let me reload. I'm letting you reload, so, there we go. Oh, yes, yes, there's so much food here. Even though you're a ghoul, I technically can't eat you, but you're considered human for some reason. I don't know why. All right, open sesame. It's gonna be a vault full of food in here. Can't wait. But this is actually such a good way to play, because every person I kill, I just immediately get health from them. Yeah, I'm playing on an easier difficulty, but I don't need to waste any resources on stim packs or anything. I can just immediately eat what I just lost for free. Batters up, bitch. All right, and then since I'm low on health, just eat up everyone again. Some of that something something I've been saving up, you know? That strange meat pie. Since it does give me 100 health. Come on, come on. Bonk, there we go. Huh. Hold on, Nick. I don't, I'm ignoring this conversation. I'm hungry. No, 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 no. Excellent. Okay, now what? Hey, could you not smoke that? Um, I got this asthma thing. Don't mind what's on my, in my duffel bag on my back either. Hey, Nick, come on. I know you're completely useless, but could you please open the door? Thank you. <laughs> you're just scurrying around. I'm gonna go eat another corpse while you're doing that. <laughs> I'm hungry. Hey, Nick, do you have a gun or anything? <laughs> you're just getting the crap. Oh, there's your gun. Wow, you finally pulled it out. Jesus Christ, you're useless. I'm gonna have fun with you. Oh, jeez, I don't know what that's gonna mean, but I'm gonna have extra fun with you, buddy. There we go. <laughs> Blew off his leg. Now we're gonna have fun with you, buddy. Ooh, what if I got Skinny Malone as my prisoner instead of this random guy on my back? He'd be like a little collector novelty item in my, uh, freezer, refrigerator, aka my shed. You there, you there, and you. Alright, just don't kill Skinny, Nick. Please do not kill Skinny. Let's get my fists out now. <laughs> Beat the crap out of him. Oh, that didn't do a whole lot of damage. Oh, wait. Is he immune? Holy crap. He's got a lot of health. Hold on. Let me quick save. He's got a lot of health. Ooh. I'm gonna eat Darla real quick. Bonk. All right, here. Let me let me quick save right before he dies and finish him off with my fist just in case Nick kills him. Yes. <laughs> yes. All right. Kidnap him. Yes. Wow. He's a big boy on my back, that's for sure. Valentine's probably really curious. So what do you do after you kill all these people and then start searching them? What exactly do you take? But underground and surrounded is not the best place to talk. We're not surrounded, you idiot. Oh, it's Skinny Malone still alive, technically. Oh, no. I'm not gonna be able to keep him. I'm trying to execute him with a flare gun. It's not doing its job, really. Oh, there we go. It worked. You're a heavy Nick, you're gonna have to speak up. I can't hear you over the sound of me eating him. I was gonna head back to Sanctuary with Skinny here, slap him on the table, stick an apple in his mouth, oil him up nice and well, and cook him for a feast dinner, but I guess not. I could take less radiation from <laughs> eating lead belly. That could be a good idea. So when I eat my friends, I won't get any radiation from it. <laughs> They're probably so freaked out that I'm playing with some random unconscious body. I stay. Where are we headed? Nowhere. You're not heading anywhere. If you guys have uneasy stomachs, I suggest you look away. No, 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 no. Get back in your pillory. What are you guys doing? Oh, it's... Uh, okay. <laughs> I guess they had sore necks after sitting like that for a while. All right. Now watch this. Mmm. Delicious. Strange meat pie. How many can I make? Oh, I can make a lot. Holy shit. All right. I'm going to sit here among my friends here in the freezer and eat some of this uh, man meat I got. Mmm, delicious. Glad I can enjoy this meal with all my friends here. 
Oh, yes, now I can move the body onto the table. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> Piper's got a nice view right here. Nice. I'll, uh, I'll, put his, I'll put his head right here, too. So you guys remember what he looks like. Dad says not to talk to strangers. Yeah, don't talk to strangers, especially me. What would you give me for uh, 16 stolen tomatoes? 48 caps, I'll take it. Mind if I sit down at the bar here? So what's your name? You come here often? I'm gonna eat my uh, strange meat pie if you don't mind. <laughs> she doesn't seem to mind at all. All right, I think I only need to do this one mission with Nick Valentine, and then he can become one of my official prisoners. Let's get down to business. Take it. Actually, I just stole something off the desk because I was spamming A. Sorry about that. Uh, it's, it's a tendency of mine. At least it was just an item. Usually yes. I just steal people. I can't wait to eat Kellogg. That's gonna be cool, actually. No, Nick, come with me. I want you to be there when I eat Kellogg right in front of you. I don't feel like actually walking the entire wasteland to, you know, get to Kellogg, so I'm just gonna teleport there. All right, I'm not entirely sure if I can eat synths yet. I think I need to upgrade that to be able to do it. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can. Oh man. Can I at least kidnap a synth? That could be fun. Uh, it doesn't look like I can. How stupid. All right, you know, I'm just running through this. Okay, finally, we made it to the fight. I'm gonna take a quick nap real quick to regen my health. And then for intimidation factor, I'm gonna eat some man meat. All right, Nick, you have execute authority. Let's do this. Yeah, I'm actually not here to talk. I'm here to eat. I'm hungry. It's gonna let me stand behind you like this? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's real funny. But you dead is gonna be even funnier. Piece of shit. Oh, shit. Should have probably quick saved in a safe place before I started this fight. Fuck. Bonk. All right, Kellogg, it's just you and me now. <laughs> Nick's useless. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, take that beating, old man. Oh, God, I need some man meat. I'm about to die. Ah, uh, what the hell? Oh, there we go. Okay, I got him. I'm gonna take his clothes, too. Cool. I'm the new Kellogg. I'm the new boogeyman of the Commonwealth. I am Jeffrey Dahmer. D Dahmer. D not Dahmer. Dahmer. All right, Kellogg. Nick, look away. Ooh, that's going on the gram right there. Don't let me spoil your meal. <laughs> you didn't spoil anything. In fact, I like when people watch. All right, discuss your findings with Piper. Oh, why is she back at Diamond City? What the hell? She's supposed to be in the pillory. Did she escape? Hold on, hold on. Well, I guess from here on out, I don't actually have to be a nice or good person in Diamond City, and I can kill anyone who I want. Really curious as to how you're not in your pillory, Piper, but it's fine. It's whatever. It's chill. All right, let's see if we can't find someone isolated that I can kidnap. It's Diamond City Radio. Okay. Kidnap the radio host <laughs> for ransom. All right, Travis. You're gonna be a good boy, and you're gonna be real quiet for me, all right? <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> Ah, oh, he shot some guns. Okay, just gonna just gonna kidnap you. Okay, perfect. Oh shit, shit, shit. People are upset. People are upset. All right, <laughs> guy, looks like I gotta make my escape again. All right, another friend to add to our stash here. I wonder if any of the settlers have walked in here and was like, "Holy crap!" In you go, buddy. There we go. Preston hated that. Well, I don't care what Preston likes or dislikes. He's an asshole. I don't like him at all. How did a microscope get in here? What the hell? I didn't put that there. All right, well, I'm going to stash my human blood and meat in here for uh, the meantime while I uh, take a break. So I got all my food in here for next time. Sheffield here. He's still chilling. I think that's where we're going to be ending it for another video of our playthrough with Jeff Uri Dahmer here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to be chilling out here with my friends. This one's still fresh. That's right. Mmm, delicious. If you're new, consider subscribing. Subscribing, leaving your feedback with a like and a comment whether you guys want to see more of this or any other game would be much appreciated and in the meantime check out some more of my videos here and i'll see you guys in the next one peace